The Pulse of Spokane is a broad show that showcases many different things in our community, sponsored by Local 29 Firefighters Union, Well-Dressed Walrus, and Homes for You. Hi there, and welcome to the Pulse of Spokane. My name is Emma Olring, and today I am talking to Tara Michelli. How are you doing, Tara? I'm good, thanks. Thanks for being with us in this weird virtual world, but we're really excited to talk to you today. And it's, so it's the new normal for a little while. I know, it really <laughs> is. It's weird, but we're hanging in there. And I'm excited because you have your own line within Cutco Cutlery. You're website and everything you promote is through Blades by Tara. Can you mm -hmm. give us some background? What does that mean? What do you sell? What led you here? Give us some context to what you're doing. Sure, so I've been with Cutco for almost 12 years now. Cutco is an American made company. So we're celebrating 71 years this year and it's kitchen cutlery, so kitchen knives. So you can kind of see behind me um, some oh, of yeah. the knives that I have. Yeah, so kitchen knives, sporting knives, uh, garden tools, cookware, we have it all, but it's all American made, um, guaranteed forever, dishwasher safe, um, we sharpen free for life. And so I've been an independent contractor with Cutco for almost 12 years. So Blades by Tara is my team. That's amazing. So within those 12 years, where have you had to kind of adapt? Because I can imagine, you know, being kind of on your own in this world of technology that's changed in ways you've had to promote differently. Can you talk a little bit about the timeline of what you did in the beginning versus what you do now? Sure. So, well, in the beginning, you know, you start off with friends and family and, and starting to learn how to sell in general and then ask for referrals. And um, I do a lot of trade shows uh, normally. <laughs> so yeah. I'm at a lot of events. Um, and then with this whole shift, it's been a little bit different. So everything's been virtual, obviously. Um, I'm 100% virtual right now and on the phone, So, which is okay for okay. me. I work both residentially with clients. The hardest part is not being able to go see my clients, um, sharpen their knives, um, be in their home or at a show where they can come and find me at a booth. But I also work on the business gift side. And so the virtual part has been okay because my division is really big. So I haven't had the drive time, which has been great. I was oh, in Billings last week. Billings, Montana last week. I was in Seattle this morning. So um, it's been terrific for that part. <laughs> but mm -hmm. uh, yeah, there's some challenges. There's some positives. So yeah. So when you talk about that region that you're selling to, are you limited within that region? What is it exactly? Um, kind of explain your demographics of where you're selling. Sure. So uh, Cutco is divided up into territories. I can sell anywhere in the United States over the phone or whatever, but when I work a trade show or work with a business, I have territories. So my trade shows are Eastern Washington, Idaho, and Montana. So I travel okay. a lot. Um, yeah, wow, that's a lot of ground. I have cover. Washington and Idaho and Montana. So yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, and then I'm curious, what do you tell people is the difference between your knives and other big sellers out there? I know you mentioned American made dishwasher safe, you go and cut or you go and help at their door, but can you explain a little bit more? Like what makes you special? Sure. Well, American made is huge. Um, we, our knives stay sharp for seven to 10 years on average, but I think that our guarantee is probably the biggest seller because it is guaranteed okay. forever. You don't need receipts. You don't need purchase orders. If you've got our product, you've got the guarantee. So it's generational. I've had clients that have gotten it from their grandparents um, 50 years oh, wow. ago, you know, they bought it 60 years ago and the guarantee is still there. So if they break a tip, they melt a handle, anything goes wrong with it, we're going to take care of them. Amazing. Um, yeah. And then I am curious, what keeps you motivated when you're selling, you know, on your own and you're kind of your own freelancer in all of this? Um, how do you continue the drive of it all? Because I think now that people are working from home, 
And this is something that maybe you kind of have the upper hand on because you're doing a lot of this work anyways. Um, what is some advice that you have to people that are doing work like yours that is very much dependent on your own motivation? Well, I think for me, what drives me is I'm a social person. I love people. Right now, every salesperson out there should be on the phone. Our reach rate is huge. People are answering the phone more than they ever have before, and they want to mm -hmm. talk to other humans. So that's number one. Number two is showing a little appreciation to your clients that you have right now. So client appreciation yeah. has never been more needed than right now. So um, giving a gift or a handwritten card or something like that is huge. And when you're giving a gift of an American made product and supporting the American economy, I think that's just a no brainer. Yeah, that's amazing. Um, what is it like selling in Eastern Washington? Like in the Spokane area, I'm not sure if that's exactly where you are, mm -hmm. uh, you know, right now. Yeah. Um, what does your clientele look like? Like you mentioned, I know a lot of it is kind of families passed down that have used your brand for a long time. Are you finding that a lot in Spokane? Are you finding new families? I'm wondering kind of who your basis of clients are. Um, my biggest uh, qualification is that they have to eat. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that makes that's easy. the biggest thing. <laughs> so, um, Cutco owners are so widely ranged. Um, we can go for, I've sold it to college students that were raised on Cutco one knife at a time. I've sold it to people that are just ready to have some good knives. Um, I, it, it's really such a wide range of people. If they like good quality and they're tired of replacing things over and over and over again, those are the people that I sell it to. Yeah, that makes total sense. Um, and I, I would assume that since you're such a people person, going and being able to sharpen people's knives and, you know, make that connection and hear their stories, that has to be fun for you, correct? It, it definitely is. And the stories never get old. I have heard so many different stories and sometimes it's a matter of they found it when they were out um, hunting. They found a knife, a cutco knife that was left in the woods or oh they found God. it in a house that they just moved into. Um, and, and sometimes the stories get really fun. Like the husband threw away half of the scissors because our scissors come apart and he thought he broke them. So the wife was really angry. So she <laughs> rug him up by the ear to, to buy some new scissors. But yeah, so the stories get really fun. And, and that's, I think one of my favorite things is my motto is to make my clients, my friends and my friends, my clients. So it's just oh, a circle amazing. and, and I absolutely love it. I'm just the girl that happens to sell knives. Yeah, <laughs> just what you do. And I'm so glad yeah. you love it. It's very obvious that this is something you're passionate about. Um, where can people find you? Is there a website? Do you have, you know, social media? What's the best way to get in sure. contact with you if people are in need and, of knives? So my Facebook page is Blades by Tara, and that's T-A-R-A. -A. And then that's my website, too. It's bladesbytara.com. So. Amazing. And then and, I'm sure And then they can always some... find me at a show. <laughs> Oh yeah, that too. Um, once you have your once the show start up, just come and come and see me there. I know. We pray that that can happen so soon. It's gonna happen. It looks happen. like things might happen. be getting better. I know. Well, Some thank of my you so much. Territory is starting to open, so that's a nice thing. Oh, that's so. That is true. I guess since you're all Montana over. and Idaho, yeah, yeah, yeah. How nice. Well, great. You have yeah, good things helpful. coming. I can feel it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks, Tara. Thanks for chatting today. And everyone, thanks, thanks for watching for having the Pulse me on. of Spokane. Yeah, bye-bye. All right. We believe every person is created in the image of God with immeasurable beauty and worth that people should not be defined by their present condition or past mistakes. We are all broken. We need each other. Healing for our brokenness begins with connection with understanding how much we are loved by a good God. And with healing comes change, the potential for joy and meaning. No one was created for mere survival on the streets, for an existence blurred by mind-numbing substances. Each person is created with a purpose, a unique gift no one else can offer the world. Our job is to help them rediscover it. Real people, Real Change, Union Gospel Mission.
Welcome to Apex Plaza, Spokane's one-stop cannabis destination. Apex Cannabis features thousands of economy, value, and luxury cannabis products. Canagear features hemp-based CBD products, glass, goods, and gear. Stop by 1325 North Division to experience the Apex difference. This product has intoxicating effects and may be habit forming. Marijuana can impair concentration, coordination, and judgment. Do not operate a vehicle or machinery under the influence of this drug. There may be health risks associated with the consumption of this product. For use only by adults 21 and older, keep out of the reach of children. The economy is getting stronger, banks are lending again, and interest rates are at historic lows. Now is a great time to buy your dream home. The caring and knowledgeable professionals at Homes for You have been helping people just like you for over 20 years. They take the time to listen to what you want and will help you find just the right home in Washington or Idaho. Real estate is what we do at Homes for You, 928 5782, or visit online at homes, the number four, youspokane.com. Hi, this is Kurt Stockwell with Well-Dressed Walrus. We are a local website design and development company here in Spokane. What we do is build beautiful, usable websites for local businesses. The website needs to be beautiful. It needs to be usable for your users, your customers, and yourself. Contact us anytime. We'd love to talk with you about your online marketing. Thanks for watching. Ask the host a question, recommend a guest, or check out any of our other programs on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or SpokaneTalksMedia.com. Sponsored by Local 29 Firefighters Union, Well-Dressed Walrus, and Homes for You.